broadcast comes to you today from inside Ford Field in downtown Detroit. Welcome to this battle between two NFC North Division rivals. Detroit matches up against Chicago. The teams have taken the field and lined up for the kickoff and they're ready to get this one started. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. This one is fielded by Chapman. Chapman finds an open area on the return and brings it back to the 38. The Bears have sat down one of their starting cornerbacks. Philip Buchanan will step in as the starter. Detroit lines up in a 4 3. This one is handed off. Schweiger comes up to make the play at the 40 yard line. The defense held their positions and didn't let him get very far. Second and eight. Ball on the 40 yard line. The Lions come out in a 4-3. Gets the call. The most is there for the tackle at the 47. A successful running attack requires good blocking up front to be effective. Third and inches. Ball on the 47-yard line. The Lions with a four-man front. Rowing. Interception. That was a cover two scheme. Its basic premise is to keep the play in front of you. You can take calculated risks because you know someone has your back. So after the interception, now it's first and ten. Let's go. Let's go now. We're talking about me. Be careful. Watch out. Tucks it away. Under pressure. Gets the pass off. He hits his receiver. Washington comes up to make the play at the 25-yard line. When you give him time, he'll find a receiver. Yeah, and with this guy, he doesn't throw it behind him. He doesn't throw it over their head. He throws it where they're going. Ball on the 25 yard Ball line. On the 25 yard line. Regular. Danny, Danny, Danny. The Bears line up in a 4 3 with the throw. And he steps out of bounds at the 18. Look here. He does two things perfectly on this play. One, he watches the ball all the way into his hands to make the catch. And two, he shows great awareness and gets both feet down in bounds. <laughs> That's a nice looking play. So with the play in question, the coach has decided to challenge the call. Yeah, and they might get this call reversed. It appeared he did a great job of keeping his balance along the sidelines. Yeah, and the only question is, did he step out? That's what I think they're looking for in the booth. It's an incomplete pass. The player was out of bounds. So the coach looks a lot smarter after getting the play reversed in his team's favor. It didn't hurt that the official had some great replays to look at. And they made it easy to overrule. Dropping back. Pumps. Pressure coming. Big man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. He won't be winning any races, but he's good at getting after the quarterback. And let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. It's now third and long after the set. Jackson, the motion man. The rush is on with the throw. 
The pass ball's incomplete. They won the battle at the line of scrimmage and forced a bad throw. Every quarterback needs a little time to look over the field. There we saw a defense who wasn't given any time at all. Shane Graham will try to put them ahead with this field goal. The veteran connecting for the field goal. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. This one is taken by Chapman. Their defense looking for a second straight interception. The Bears will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Hill, the deep man, with a counter play. Running with a lot of room in front. And he ducks out of bounds at the 34-yard line. He blew right through the defense. The offensive line dominated the defensive line there, and they sprang the runner. First and 10. Ball at the 34-yard line. Nickelback in this time. Hands it off to the back. Wade comes up to make the play at the 37-yard line. Mixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. Second and eight. Ball on the 37-yard line. On the 10, 10. I'll come through, baby. Nothing. Nothing. Here they come. This guy's a tremendous asset to this defense. He just demonstrated on that one. After the sack, they'll be looking at third and long here. Brooks out of the gun. With a deep throw to the right side. Pass ball's incomplete. Good timing, getting in between the ball and the receiver to save what would have been a big game. Campbell is back to receive this pick. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. So they have first and ten here. They'll go with a play fake. Closing in, looking left for the long pass. Almost intercepted. That was a good play, turn bad play. Good because their zone defense worked well. Bad because he dropped the interception. That's one he wishes he could have back. Second and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Yeah, you see. Only one man back. Gets rid of it. Bullocks makes Jones the tackle at the, the 27. Jones goes down after a minimal game. Third and eight. Ball on the 27 yard line. The Bears come out in a nickel package. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hand it off to the back. They'll go with a play fake. Throws it right on target to the wide receiver. That play won't help their third down conversion percentage today. I wonder what the receiver was thinking. Running a route that wasn't going to put him past the first down marker anyway. Right. 
Very solid defensive effort to force the three and out. And he chooses not to return this one. The first and ten will start the drive at the 27 yard line. First and ten. Troy comes out in a 4 3. He tucks it away. Neely gets right in there and brings him down. Looks for a seam in the middle, but there's nothing there. The defense had great penetration, and they were right there to cover their gap assignments. Second and 12. Ball on the 25 yard line. No stop, no stop that motor. The Lions with a four man front. Looking for room. Thomas comes up to make the play. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass play. They'll be faced with a long third down play here. McAllister, the lone setback. Let's turn it up, D. Gets rid of it. And it's complete. Buchanan is there for the tackle. The defense dropped everybody back, but he was able to find some space and make the catch for the first down. That was a good read off the line by the receiver. Recognized his own coverage, made a slight adjustment to his route. The quarterback knew where he would be, made a good throw, and they convert it for a first down. The Lions come out in a 4-3. On first down, gets the pass off. Quentin Jammer has it. He anticipated that one perfectly, and he's right there for the interception. He's one of those guys who's always prepared. He watches film, studies plays, learns tendencies. Let me tell you, he's going to be one heck of a coach someday if that's what he wants to do. After the interception, they'll set up shot at the 44-yard line. The Bears line up in a 4-3. Here comes the blitz with the pass. Almost picked off. And number third, and the coverage on the play. The intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. Ace, 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 ace. All right, here we go. Watch the man. The Bears with a four-man front. Bolger sends a man in motion. They give it to the halfback. Rucker is there for the tackle at the 44. He tried to pick his way through the middle, but there was no room. That's right. And when the middle of your offensive line is eaten up like that, you got to try and get to the outside. But they wouldn't let him get away. Ball on their own 44. Ball on the 44-yard line. Keep it Pressure looking for the long completion. Washington is there on the stop. And they were each jockeying for position while that one was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass on the defense. On the defense. On the 27. First down. Washington looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. First, First and ten. The Bears come out in a 4 3. the back. Music for them. Rucker is there for the tackle at the 24. They might not be busting off big games, but those linemen are really working hard down there. Just about a three-yard game. It's second down and six to go. Here we go. Bolger starts out of the shotgun. They're coming with the blitz. Complete to the wide receiver. 
McDavid Johnson, stops him at the 15. A lot of pressure the on the quarterback, but he still got away a good pass. Yeah, and here's one thing. He's one of the smartest guys in football at the quarterback position. He's always watching film and studying defenses, and you see all that First hard work ten. paying off ball on plays ball. like that. Get it up! The last red zone trip resulted in a field goal. Crosses it out to the left. Spins it one. Number 30 is there on the no, stop at the nine-yard line. Jones picks up some tough yards there. Nine yards, they'll be in the end zone. Let's update you on the injury situation. They're saying it's a minor pain in his arm, and he might be able to get back into the game. Lobs one into the end zone. Touchdown, Detroit. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and the touchdown. Point after is good. Scoring a touchdown not only puts points on the board, it sends a message to the other team that if you execute properly, they won't be able to stop you. And they say 90% of the game is half metal. Graham is back and ready to put this one in the air. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. This one is taken by Chapman. Ready now for the first play of the drive. And the defense will be looking for another pick. Washington returns to the game after being shaken up earlier. turn it up, D. They'll go from the I formation. Come on. Gives the ball off. Number 38 is there for the tackle. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. Gain of four. Ball on their own 24. Ball on the 24 yard line. Hey, watch the screen. Detroit goes with a four man front. This one is handed off. Play action. Brings it down looking to run. Number 95 is there on the stop at the 29. Pretty good coverage downfield, so he decided to pack it in, picked up a handful in the process. And that's just the kind of thing he'll do. He's very good at creating opportunities with his leg. Ball on their own 29. The Lions line up in a 4-3. Stuart Schweiger has it. Excellent man-to-man -man coverage on that play as he comes away with the takeaway. And below you can see how these two teams have done in the turnover battle. So they're ready to go on offense after the interception. They'll start at the 30-yard line. The Bears with a four-man front. Driving down, pass on first down. With the pass... Ooh, nearly picked off. Foley had his hands on it. He's a pretty good cover linebacker. He can run with most guys, and he gets good position. Then he reads the pass, and he makes his move. But he'll drop a few like that one. Second and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. Go make the play. Bolger back in the shotgun. Drops back, gets the pass off. He went up there, and he got it. When you think about guys with great hands, he's very close to the top, John. I'll tell you what. He does a great job of using his hands and not letting the ball get into his body. He's worked very hard to improve his pass catching. And I think he's become one of the best out there. He got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. Detroit has jumped out to an early lead as the first quarter comes to a close with a score of 10-0. 
teams as what size and we'll start with the second quarter. They're inside the 20. Ball on the 18-yard line. And they're threatening again with the ball inside the 20. Jones takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 15-yard line. Let's go, defense. Tackle. Set. It's showtime, baby. Rowing. And it's caught. Jeremy Stevens can't get anything more after making the catch. Nine yards, they'll be in the end zone. Nine yards. Everything you've got. Only one man in the backfield. They'll put this one in the air, trying to convert. Under pressure, throws it. David comes up to make the play at the five. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. See how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. It's second and goal at the seven. Bolger from the shotgun. Pumps. Pressure coming with the pass. Davis comes up to make the play at the four. Watch this here. He gets his helmet right under his chin and wham, he takes him straight to the turf. Gets the toss to the right. And no score. Touchdown. Look at him here. He wasn't going to be stopped on that one. He's a hard runner. And he just shrugs off the defenders, and he gets in for a touchdown. Another drive, John, that results in a touchdown, and this game is quickly getting out of hand. This defense has a solid core of players. They just don't seem to be playing very well in this one. They still have to go, and maybe they can turn things around. But they have to find a way to swing the momentum in their favor. Graham Detroit comes in to kick off. This one is handled by Chapman. That interception brought their last drive to a sudden halt. After collecting themselves on the sidelines, let's see what happens here. First Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Lions line up in a 4-3. And he gets the delayed handle. Thomas comes. 
comes up to make the play at the 24-yard line. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Second and six. Ball on the 24-yard line. Detroit using three linebackers. Steps up with the throw. Incomplete pass. This defense, John, knows how to create a lot of pressure. Putting pressure on the quarterback can disrupt passing, but pressuring the receivers can do the same thing. If you can play physically on the outside, bump them off their routes, hold them up at the line, you can take away his receiving options, forcing him to just get rid of it. The Bears line up in a five-receiver set this time with the pass, and it's intercepted. The 30. The key to the play was pressure. They force a quarterback to get rid of it before he's ready. And when he's rushing his throws out there, bad things are going to happen to this offense. First Following the interception, ball it's ball now ball first ball and ten. They have a big, big lead, and they're on the move again inside the 20. Right, here we go. Misdirection. Bullock comes up to make the play at the 11-yard line. Eight-yard game. Eleven yards to the end zone. The defense lines up in the nickel. On the call. Play action. Gets the pass off. Nearly intercepted. Almonds was the intended recipient on that short throw. Webster with the coverage. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. Chicago lines up in a 4-3. Here they come with the throw. The back breaking free. Touchdown, Lions. Hold on, we've got a penalty on the play. Goes against the offense, takes away the touchdown. So on third down, they'll be looking to get it to the eight-yard line or further. Chicago comes out in their nickel package. Dropping back. Closing in. Gets the pass off. And he dropped it. The coaching staff thinks that he has some of the best hands in the team. Kind of surprising to see him drop a pass like that. Attempt. The Better the field. Field. Not every drive is going to get you a touchdown, so getting three was big. Now they got to go over what worked and what didn't, so the next drive will get them a TD. Detroit is lined up with a kickoff. Chapman back deep to return. This one is handled by Chapman. The Bears need to rebound quickly as they start this drive at the 20. First Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Only one man in the backfield. A little misdirection. The Loach is there for the tackle. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. So it's second and ten. All on the 20-yard line. Let's go, Nothing. They don't get Detroit goes with a four-man front. Here we come. Watch it out. Going deep. 
He couldn't control it. You have to be able to make those Hill, catches. The intended receiver on the play. Third and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Here we go. Watch him in. From the gun. With the pass. Just couldn't get that pass under control. Terrible way to end that drive, John. When you put the ball right on the money, you expect it to be caught. When you put it on the money on third down and it's dropped, sometimes that's like a dagger. Larson is ready to pump this one away. Campbell back to return. From the 41. Campbell doesn't have a whole lot of room to work with getting it to the 47 yard line. It's first and 10. Start the drive at the 47 yard line. First and 10. Throwing. David is there on the stop at the 40. Chad Johnson enjoys playing football, and he's one of those guys who's always talking out there. First and 10. Ball on the 40 yard line. That's on the baby. From the gun. Here comes the blitz. Looking left for the long pass. He made the catch. Bullocks comes up to make the play at the one-yard line. When Randy Moss is on the field, the defense always needs to have a safety back there looking to help out in the deep pattern. One of the things that does is help loosen up the defense, giving you room to run. The last time they were down here, they settled for a field goal. Ooh, what a hit on the quarterback. They brought the house on that play, John, getting in there to bring him down. And when you bring that many guys, you better get it there before he throws it. Because if he can get it to one of those receivers, a lot of times it's six points. He needs seven, seven yards for a touchdown. On the seven yard line. Chicago comes out in their nickel package. With the carry, number 30 is there on the stop at the one. Jones kept his legs moving, gets seven hard-earned yards. It's third and goal at the one-yard line. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. Fires to the end zone. Johnson was the intended receiver on that play. Graham hits out to try this field goal. The field goal was taken is good. That's his third successful attempt. The key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. And I'm sure they'll think a touchdown for their next one. Detroit is lined up with the kickoff. Chapman back deep to return. This one is taken by Chapman. The Bears have their work cut out for them as they take over at the 20. They'll so they have first and 10 here. First and 10. Watch the snap now. On the 10. The Lions come out of the quarter defense. He's going to run. The Loach comes up to make the play. They come up just short in the second down. You know, the quarterback dropped back to pass, didn't see anyone open, so he just took off running. 
second and one. Ball on the 29-yard line. Play two quarters, two quarters. The Lions come out in a nickel package. Gets the pass on. This pass is incomplete. And he throws incomplete because he had major pressure. The corner came on a blitz and he sprinted for the quarterback. Guys love the opportunity to get a sack. And that time he just missed taking him down. Third and one. Ball on the 29-yard line. There you go. Come on. The offense has had trouble moving the sticks on third down so far. Hand it off. Willis is there Hero on the stop on the at the 33-yard line. Yard now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. First Almost at the two-minute mark Ball now. on the 33-yard line. Defense, get ready. Keep the throttles down. Only one man in the backfield. And he gets the late handle. Yeah, right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Two-minute warning coming up. Ball on the 36-yard line. Brooks back in the shotgun, dropping back, brings it down, looking to run. Picked up a few yards on the scramble, John. He's one of those guys who's willing to run to make something happen. You have to be aware of that kind of thing on defense. Two minutes to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. The Lions come out in a 4-3. Hand it off to the back. Number 97 comes up to make the play at the 48-yard line. Here's a no huddle. It's a good way to keep the defense off balance. Pass play here on first down. Throws it. And he, oh, he had it and lost it incomplete. There's not one wide receiver who can ever claim he's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. Eighth play of this drive. Ball on the 48-yard line. Out of the shotgun. He just ran out of time. He's got to do a better job of feeling the rush. You always want to keep your eyes downfield. You have to know or feel when that rush is getting to you. You have to have a time clock in your head so you can get the pass off just a beat earlier. It hasn't been easy when he's dropped back the pass as we take a look at the numbers. Punt number three is upcoming. Fair catch. They'd like to add a few more points to this lead, but we'll need to do a good job with clock management. First and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Chicago goes with a four-man front. Pressure growing. This one will be spotted at the 38-yard line. It's his third tackle of the contest. Good throw, good catch to move the chains. You know, as a receiver, all you have to do is get a step, and this guy's going to put the ball on you. First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. The Bears come out in a nickel package. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. Drops the intercept. Sometimes in zone coverage, a quarterback will throw to a spot where his receiver is supposed to be. That time, the only one there was a defender who couldn't make the catch. Second and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Clear! Clear! Watch your eyes. 
Here we go. It's a blitz. Throws it. This and pass is incomplete. Pass. Johnson, Johnson was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Third and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. On the carry. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. And he steps out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Look here. He does two things perfectly on this play. One, he watches the ball all the way into his hands to make the catch. And two, he shows great awareness and gets both feet down in bounds. Hey, that's a nice looking play. hands and wonder what the heck happened. Second and ten. Ball on the 21 yard line. Keep the throttle down. Troy comes out in the dive back. And give it to the halfback. Is there on this stop. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on it. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. Gain of about a yard. Ball on their own 21. Ball on the 21 yard line. Rose Incomplete. Chicago fails once again to get the first down and that's seven times. Yeah, and that's huge for the defense to keep stepping up on third down like that. They're a solid group of guys who make key stops. The offense couldn't get it done in the lineup to punt. From the 40-yard line. Not much return room that time, and he goes down at midfield. They'll Ball take the 50-yard line. First and ten. Let's turn it up, D. Let's go. From the gun, Moss, the man in motion. Dropping back the pass on first down. Gets rid of it. This one falls incomplete. Plenty of pressure, and he barely gets the pass away. This defensive coordinator understands that pressure is the key to forcing the offense into making mistakes. If his players keep playing like this, he might be up for a head coaching job pretty soon. And this should be the last play of the half. Not today. You got to have it, Let's go. Yeah, you see me. I'm coming through, baby. They don't get nothing. Come on. Dropping back. Under pressure, he's going for it all. Trying for the end zone before halftime. At the end of two, the score is 23 to nothing. Lions. Janikowski looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. That one is out of the end zone. You talk about protecting the ball and working the clock. All of those things come into play now as they try to put this game away. Right. 
First, first and ten. Chicago lines up in a 4 3. Looking for the long completion down the left side. The 40. Receiver running and breaks free. The 10. Touchdown, Detroit. When you get this kind of execution, you got a great chance of making a big play. Watch it here as everyone takes care of their assignment. The pass is thrown where the receiver can make the best play in the ball, and it's six points. They come onto the field and get a touchdown on the first play. That was one of those plays that an offensive coordinator dreams about. He draws it up, puts it in the playbook, tells the team to study it, and they execute it perfectly. Detroit will be kicking off. The kick off. Chapman back to return. Nice distance. This one is handled by Chapman. Kickoff return 15 yards. Chapman, Chapman takes this one back the to the 16. They'll take over at the 16-yard line. First and 10. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. The Lions line up at a 4-3. Drop in the backfield for a short loss. He came with a blitz and there wasn't anywhere to go. Yeah, and that's why you send all those guys to plug up the hole. At that time, there were no holes at all. It's second down and a long way to go. Hill, the lone back. He gets the handoff on the delay. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. So they dug themselves into a hole here, a long third down situation. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. Incomplete as the defender packs it away. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and rested. Unable to get anything going on that series, they'll have to punt it away here. Andy signals for the fair catch. So they have first and ten here. Chicago goes with a four-man front. Throws it almost intercepted. Johnson was his intended target. David was there on the guard. Second and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. One back. Set. Chicago oh, comes out in a dime package. Receives the handoff. Nice play fake. With the pass, Andy goes out of bounds at the 49. You know, you hear coaches talk about presence of mind and knowing where you are in the field, and this is where you see that talk come into play. 46-yard line is the spot they have to get to to convert on this third down play. Let's go, let's go. The Bears come out in a 4-3. Here we come. They give it to the halfback. Davis tackles him, and they won't get the first. 
Troy can't keep their drives going, John. They failed on six third downs. Yeah, they're not calling their best plays on third down, and they're predictable, which makes it easier for the defense to make the stop. Baker comes into the game for the punt. Chapman into return. He signals for a fair catch. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Brooks out of the gun. Pass play here on first down with the pass. The wide receiver has it. Willis comes up to make the play at the 22 yard line. Good play right there. The defenders forced him to make a move that would get him nowhere. Second and eight. Ball on the 22 yard line. Let's go, defense. From the gun, drops back, gets the pass off. Stuart Schweiger picks it off. The 30. And this defense has been doing the job all day long. They've now picked off five passes. Following the interception, it's now first and ten. Watch your eyes. Come on. You turn it Chicago up. comes out in a 4 3. With a counterplay. Number 30 is there for the tackle at the nine. Took the handoff and picks up a nice game. Yeah, that was a ramble. Reminiscent of his early playing days. It's first and goal at the nine-yard line. It's showtime, baby. All right, let's go. The last time they were inside the 20, they came away with three points. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. With the throw, and he makes the grab. Touchdown, Lions. Randy Moss is the biggest threat in the NFL. When you're playing him, you have to change everything you do on defense. You always have to make sure that you have him accounted for. And usually with two guys, or he's going to make a big play on you. Graham comes in for the extra point. The extra, extra point, point attempt, attempt is good. good. And so they're handed great field position and cash in. Yeah, when you give this team field position like that, you can practically take a touchdown to the bank. Detroit is lined up for the kickoff. Chapman back deep to return. This one is taken by Chapman. The defensive unit forced an interception the last time they were on the field. They'll Ball on their own 20. At the 20 yard line. First and 10. Detroit goes with a four-man front. Pass play here on first down. They'll run this one. Dalton comes up to make the play. Brooks had trouble getting anywhere on that play. Yeah, because the defense was in his zone. When he tried to tuck it and run, they were watching him. And they were able to swarm to the ball and bring him down before he got very far. Ball on their own 23. 23-yard run. Play football. Hill, the lone back. Watch the ball. Let's go, man. Looking to run it here. Willis is there on the stop at the 25-yard line. A big part of this guy's running style is to use the blockers to set up his cut. But they were nowhere to be found on that run. Ball on their own 25. Ball on the 25-yard line. Watch it. One back. McAllister, the lone setback. Takes the delayed handoff. 
Willis comes up to make the play at the 25. They can't get the first down on that running play, and since they're not in field goal range, we should see the punt unit. They can't keep the drive alive, and they're really struggling offensively. Here in the third, they've yet to cross midfield. From the 40-yard line, Campbell doesn't have a whole lot of room to work with, getting it to 46. Ball on their own 46. The Bears come out in a 4-3. A little misdirection. Keith Bullet stopped him for his third tackle so far. Jones runs it for about three on the counterplay. Ball right around midfield. Keep the throttle down. Let's go, let's go, let's the Bears go. come out in a nickel package. Hands it off. Nice play fake. Looking for the long completion. Washington is there for the tackle at the 13. You know, I say you throw two passes a quarter to Randy Moss deep. That's eight passes a game where you have a chance for either a pass interference or a touchdown. First and ten. Ball on the 13 yard line. Jones, the lone setback. They give it to the halfback. This one will be spotted at the 14-yard line. The tackle is his fifth of the game. These plays can end up with lost yards if the defense gets through or around their blocking quickly enough. Ball on the 14-yard line. Ball on the 14-yard line. All on us, y'all. Regular. Hey, watch the screen. Folger sends hey, a man lucky, in lucky, motion. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Here we go, baby. Rock and roll. From the start, from the start. Hand it off. Mike Rucker is the man to bring him down. That's his third pick. Jones takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Third down, and they have to get to the three yard line. Chicago comes out with seven in the secondary. Down he goes. The veteran safety gets in for the sack. He continues to be a menace for opposing team. He'll come at a quarterback from the blind side and get a big hit on him. This officially will be a 37-yard attempt. But the upright is in. Good. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get it in the end zone every time. Graham Detroit comes in to kick off. off. Chapman back deep to return. This one is taken by Chapman. On their last drive, it was three plays and out, and now the offense comes out onto the field once again. The so they have first and ten here at the 20-yard line. First and ten. We're talking about Reyes. The Lions come out in a 4 3. Watch the snap down. A little misdirection. Thomas is there on the stop at the 20 yard line. Bill takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Second and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's run, man. Let's turn it up, D. 
Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Here they come. Gets rid of it. This one falls incomplete. Good call by the defense as they set the corner on a blitz. He just had too much pressure in his face to see anything, and he threw one out there. Lucky for him, it wasn't picked off. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. Dropping back. Pump fakes. Deep throw. He made the catch. Buchanan is there for the tackle at the 40-yard line. Oh, Brings it in for a big game. Almost every wide first receiver first. gets better at running routes as they get older. And this guy's no exception. First Ball on the 40-yard line. Ball on the 40-yard line. Here we go. I'll come through, baby. Careful. Detroit goes with a four-man front. He loses it. The Bears get it. They lose the ball in the backfield, but manage to recover. That was a great play to swallow up the ball carrier and put a big hit on him like that. Second and long. Ball of the 41 yard line. The Lions come out in a nickel pack. With the pass, he finds his man. Brooks with a three-yard completion. That'll bring up third down. On third down, they have to get it to the 30 for a first. Johnson, the motion man. Drops back. Throwing. It's the receiver with room to run. Jammer is there for the tackle at the 38. Good solid tackle by the corner, and they'll be stopped well short of the marker on third down. Sebastian Janikowski comes out, hoping to put points on the scoreboard for the first time. So if it wasn't evident before the kick, I think we can safely say that that one was clearly out of his range. His range? Heck, I don't even think a mule could kick it through from where they were. So they're ready to go on offense after the missed field goal. They'll start at the 45. Chicago lines up in a 4-3. Gives the ball off. Rodney Poole brought him down for his third tackle. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. you got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. Six-yard game. Ball on the 48-yard line. on the 48-yard line. Only one man back. Stevens goes in motion. With a counter play. Rucker comes up to make the play. At the 41, they blitz and it backfire. Yeah, that's a chance you take. You're hoping to get some penetration and hit him in the backfield. But if you miss, there isn't a lot of help at the next level to keep him from picking up the first down. Watch your man. Only one man in the backfield. Bolger sends a man in motion. They don't get nothing. Blue there, blue there. Give it to the halfback. The 30. Webster is there on the stunt. On the period. They get two first downs on two running plays. They're looking to pound it at him right now. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Lions ahead of the Bears. 40 0. And we'll start the fourth quarter. First and 10. Ball on the 25 yard line. The Bears oh, with a four-man front. He tucks it away. Setting up play action. And he makes the grab. Rodney Poole was in on the play again for another tick on the stat sheet. Great throw to beat the zone. I'll tell you, the defense has to do a better job of coming up and clamping down on the receiver whenever he enters their zone. Down inside the 15. Everything you got. Stay home. 
Only one man in the backfield. Here we go. So we gonna take it. Here we go, Harry. They give it to the halfback. Runs yeah. through the tackle. Ferguson comes up Jones to make the play. The At the four. Jones game. running hard, oh, going right through the arm tackles. Just four yards from the goal line now. Oh, to the tailback. Touchdown, Lions. Touchdown, Lions. He powers his way in there. He follows that push and he gets the score. So they're trying to tack on the extra point. The point after is good. The Lions pour it on with another score. Shane Graham is just about ready to kick this one away. Back to return. From the one. Kick it sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one. But it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. The Bears will start the drive at the 28-yard line. First and 10. Hill lines up behind his fullback in the eye. The most is there for the tackle at the 39. Stuart Schweiger is the injured player on the field. He'll be coming out for this next play, so we'll find out what the story is. Crocker steps into the safety role to fill in for the injured player. Turn it up now. On the chair, chair. Be careful. Only one man back. Hand it off. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. And this pass is incomplete. Bruce was the intended receiver on that play. Second and ten. Ball on the 39-yard line. Out of the shotgun. Hey, hey. Danny, Danny, Danny. Hey, that three? Dropping back. It's a throw. And he makes no, he can't hold it in. He put the ball exactly where you want to put it. Third and ten. Ball on the 39 yard line. I'm coming through, baby. Come on. I think this defense looks forward to these third down situations because they've been stopping them today. Throws it. McAllister was the one they were trying to get the ball to. The intended receiver on the play. So as we get set for the punt, let's take a look at our returners' stats. Larson will come in now to punt it away. Campbell sets up, waiting for the punt. Fair catch called for. Fair catch made at the 24-yard line. Ball on their own 24. Ball on the 24 yard line. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Chicago comes out in a 4 3. Nice play fit. Pressure coming. 
Mark Bulger gets brought down for the sack. He got taken down again, and that's the fourth time in this game he's been sacked. Ball on their own 18. Ball on the 18 yard line. Stay both now. Bulger back in the shotgun. Everything you got. They're coming with the blitz. Washington pulls him down at the 29-yard line. They brought the heat, but it was a good throw by Bulger. That's a heck of a pass. He's got those big old defensive linemen flying right at him, and he showed great composure making the right read and hitting his receiver. Third and five. Ball on the 29-yard line. Here we go, baby. Let's go now. Chicago comes out in a 4-3. Tucks it away. Play action. Throws it. Almost picked off. Foley had his hands on it. I think he was invisible out there. Wasn't even seen. And that's a break for the offense. Baker is ready to pump this one away. Chapman looks like he's ready for the return. And he chooses not to return this one. This is one of those situations where they're playing for respect. The game really hasn't gone the way they thought it would, but they have a lot of pride in their team. And I'd expect to see him keep fighting till that final whistle. First and ten. Ball on the 32-yard line. Let's go. All on us, y'all. The Lions come out in a 4-3. Blue down, blue down. And off to the tailback. Neely is there for the tackle. At the 36, Bill rumbles forward for a gain of four. Stuart Schweiger is back in there after getting taken out with an injury earlier. Troy looks like they're playing the pass as they're lined up in the dime. Line had some problems with their assignments on that play. They just couldn't get the defenders at bay. Ball on their own 35. Ball on the 35-yard line. So we gonna take it. Brooks back in the shotgun. Gets rid of it. Stuart Schweiger has to. Not a wise decision to throw that ball. After that turnover, here's how both teams are doing in that department. After the defense gets the takeaway, they're now set to go at the 39-yard line. Jones, the lone setback. Going to the air on first down. Closing in with the throw. The pass falls incomplete. Not one of his better throws, missing long. Second and ten. Ball on the 39-yard line. They ain't got nothing. Set. I can do it, baby. Hand off to the tailback. Ferguson is there on the stop at the 34-yard line. Jones with a nice burst through the middle that time. Five-yard pickup. On third down, they have to get it to the 29-yard line for a first down. Chicago comes out in their nickel package. Getting some air under this one, looking for his man deep. Touchdown, Lions. Veteran is able to come down with a pass in the end zone. This is what good, experienced receivers do. They excel when they're given the opportunity to make big plays. Graham comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. 
The Lions have it all working now as they continue to expand their lead. Detroit is lined up with a kickoff. Chapman back deep to Booming kick downfield. This one is taken by Chapman. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Detroit goes with a four-man front. Looking for something long. It's caught. Buchanan is there for the tackle. I'll tell you, I like that call. You got to keep the defense off balance. You can't come out there on first down and run every time. You have to keep them honest by throwing the ball. First ball on the 25-yard line. Ball on the 25-yard line. Yeah, you see me. Blue Dan, Blue Dan. The Lions with a four-man front. Neely comes up to make the play at the 25-yard line. Hill couldn't pick up any blocking on that play. Ball on the 25-yard line. The Lions come out in a dime package. They take off. Kama is there on the stop at the 17-yard line. He's very dangerous when he runs out of the pocket. He's a good athlete. He can hurt you when he drops back to throw, and he's a big threat to run whenever a play breaks down. If they can get it to the 15-yard line, they'll get a first down. And the fans finally get to see their red zone offense. Throws it, and this pass is completed. Number 38 comes up to make the play. This is a guy who comes to play, and he seems to make big catches when they really need him. This time, they needed to convert on third down, and he's there for the reception and the first down. You gotta believe it, it's RJ! Hey, watch the ball! Get some slack going! Hey. They'll spot this one at the eight-yard line. He is showing no mercy. He's on anything that moves, and that takedown was his ninth. And now they're eight yards away from finishing this drive with a touchdown. Brooks starts out of the shotgun. Brings it down, looking to run. Touchdown, Bears. Let me show you how they got in on that one. The quarterback drops back to pass, doesn't see anyone open. So he takes off for the end zone, and nobody even really gets a hit on him. The extra point attempt is good. The Bears still with a huge deficit to overcome. Not enough time to try to get the ball back, so the onside kick is the call. Here's the onside kick. Troy recovers it. Griffith returns this one to the 42-yard line. First ball on their ten. own 42. Ball on the 42-yard line. On the 10, 10. Chicago goes with a four-man front. Can't get it to be done. 
Washington is there for the tackle at the 47 yard line. The running back finds his way into the open field and picks up the first down. And what happened was they missed him with the blitz. And when they did that, there were no linebackers to converge. First and that's how he got by the first oh, down mark. So we gonna take it. Ain't no thing. It's on. Bolger with a man in motion. Foley is there on the stop at the 44. Jones takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Second and seven. Ball on the 44 yard line. The Bears with a four man front. It's the call. They're going to spot this one at the 46. So that tackle was his third. Nowhere to go that time. The defensive line gets very good penetration. This line's very aggressive up front. They like to stunt and use power moves to get into the backfield. A lot of teams think that the best way to move the ball on the ground against them is to run it right at them. Try and wear them out. Looks like they might be trying to do that same kind of thing. Gives the ball off. Bullocks is there for the tackle. This is a great block. Watch here. He just barrels into the defender, taking him right off the turf. Now that is a textbook block right there. on the ground. Second, Second and seven. seven. Ball on the 33-yard line. Bell, the lone setback. I can do it, man. Go make a play. Hands it off. Fakes the handoff. Rowing. The pass ball's incomplete. We're going the run as they throw here in the fourth quarter, despite the fact they're leading. Incomplete passes are never going to put a team away for you. you got to trust your running game to keep the chains moving when you have the lead late in the game. Here are the numbers when it comes to third down conversions. The Bears come out in a nickel package. I'm coming through, baby. Pull that game off. Davis is there on the stop. No surprise here. Run the ball, keep the clock moving. Now that's not a bad idea. They've got a big lead, so it's better to run. That way you keep the clock moving and decrease the chances of defense making a big play. Shane Graham ends in to try what should be about a 47-yard field goal. guys who really works hard at what he does and you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one This one is fielded by Chap. Chap takes this one back to the 15. First and ten. At the 15 yard First and ten. Hey, watch that screen! Troy comes out in a 4-3. It's a blitz. No, no. 
Rather in Brooks. Can't escape, and it's brought down. The defense relentless. They've taken the quarterback down four times. Looks like they'll go with a hurry up here. Get it up! Throwing. They'll knock him out of bounds at the 27. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. Shotgun! Shotgun! Don't stop! Don't stop that motor! All on us, y'all! Turn it up, sir! Going to the air on first down. Gets rid of it. Ooh, nearly picked off. No choice here, John. They just have to keep throwing. Yeah, they do. Running the ball isn't going to do a whole lot of good now. Second and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. Let's go. Detroit comes out in a 4-3. Come on. Let's go. Gets the pass off. This one falls incomplete. Time is working against them. Yeah, I'm thinking they're going to keep going to the air, but it might be a little too late. Third and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. The defense lines up in the nickel. Keep moving. Left, left. Gotta have it, deep. Dropping back. Steps up into the pocket. Deep throw. What a catch. Jammer is there on the stop. At the 20 yard line. They're going to go with a no huddle. Here we go. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Hey, watch the screen. He'll pass on first down. So off lob to the end zone. Nearly intercepted. Not much of a contest. One team pouring it on for a big margin of victory. This is Al Michaels with John Matt. Thank you for attending today's ball game. Please drive home safely.